Hello everybody, it's Michelle, and you might have seen my recent video where I did teddy bear place settings or teddy bear party plates, and I thought they were so adorable and so cute. I had another idea to show you guys using this idea, and I love these colors for teddy bears and black bears and polar bears, but I thought it would be super cute to do also gummy bears. So I just made some more little bears in gummy bear colors and I think they are so cute. And of course I'm going to do one more on screen for you guys today in red of course to complete the gummy bear color spectrum. And these are even simpler than the teddy bears. And like on my teddy bears with the little fuzzy inner part of the ear. We don't need to do that. All we're going to use is our two and a half inch circle just for plain ears on our gummy bears and that is all it takes. So I'm just going to cut the rim off so I can get that into my punch. And I'm using the two and a half inch circle punch but like I said before, you can use dies if you want to do that. And again, I'm not really concerned if I've got a complete circle because part of that has to go behind his head anyway, so it's not super important. We're probably going to have to cut them down a little bit anyway. So I'm just going to put these together. So I cut those off by about the same amount. And like I said in my last video for the teddy bear plates, you can probably take off about a third of your beginning complete circle. And again, I'm just going to use adhesive foam tabs from the Dollar Tree. You can use hot glue. You can use art glitter glue. You can use whatever you want. Again, I like the foam tabs for this because it kind of takes up a little bit of space of that shape of the plate right there, which is an indention from the back side. So that helps take up that space there like that. And then I'm gonna pull in one of my others here to make sure that I get my ears spaced about the same distance apart and stick that on there and that is all there is to it that's your red gummy bear you don't have to give these guys a bow tie but if you wanted to you certainly could just be sure to use solid colors only because of course gummy bears are all one color and just match the bow tie to the bear and i just have a little rubber band around them on these two i used a matching one I didn't have ones to match for the green and the orange, so I just used a clear. And again, you can, of course, add the larger plate underneath to make the full gummy bear. And I apologize again, you guys, for not being able to get all of this on screen, but I will get some photos of all of these as a complete bear. And include those at the end for you guys that way you'll be able to see all of those choices once they are complete and I think they are just adorable and again of course you can leave off the bow if you want to if that looks more gummy like to you that's just gonna dress it up a little bit and I think it is so cute so I hope you guys like this idea I had so much fun with it and if you guys do this table setting. I would love to see some photos. You can join our Facebook group, Crafty Minds, if you're not already a member of that. And we love to share photos over there to see what everyone is working on. And I think these would be so much fun. So you can go on over and join our group if you would like to share and see everyone else's projects over there. If not, you can just give a like to my regular Facebook page and watch for updates there. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also follow me on Pinterest and Instagram. And don't forget to visit my blog. I'll have the links to everything in the description below, so be sure and check them out. 
Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.